and it's gonna be interesting to see if he's gonna add a really high damage percent against his friend's base here and what he's gonna do. So they're already right. starting it off with a Lava Lillian attack, it seems. Yep, so you've got, well, you've got a little bit of everything here. You've got a uh, Go Laloon. Go Bolaloon. Go Bolaloon. Go Bolaloon. <laughs> go Bolaloon. <laughs> Bowlers, Lava Loon. And uh, right hand side here, here comes the Barbarian King. Golem is already down. Wall Breakers, there we go. There's the opening in the wall. I didn't see that at first. Here come the heroes. Here come the bowlers. Nowhere to go but in through that wall, hopefully. And they're going to get that air defense down out of the way. There's the jump spell. Good jump. Notice how it adds the access to about four different closures. Yeah, that's right. And look at this. They're coming up. They're, the Clan Council troops are coming up. There's the Baby Dragon doing tons of damage. And, of course, he goes down, but the Town Hall goes down as well. This is such a hard push that they're to get to that Eagle Artillery and turn that thing off because that's going to do lots of damage and uh, stop the progression of the attack here. Yep, dead center Eagle Artillery, always tough. There's the Freeze Spell, helps stop that Inferno Tower. Second air defense going down as well. And uh, maybe that was the third air defense, rather. And the Hounds are headed after over that last air defense. 44% damage, Hay Spell, speeding up the balloons. Love that combination again. I hate to repeat that, but the faster first attack of the balloons combined with the haste spell just makes them so potent. That's right. So uh, we still have a Lava Hound up with a few balloons, but of course that Infernal Tower, since it is uh, centered like that, is difficult for them to get to That's it. That's a tough one. Uh, but they will go down. All the balloons will go oh. down. That Infernal Tower just Man. does such good work. Check um, it out. There is almost no, there are no defenses left anywhere at the bottom. Over on the left-hand side, there's all these unprotected buildings. This <laughs> could be close to a 90% attack. Yeah. Just this cluster of defenses right here that are going to prevent the three-star really well-planned out attack. There's so many different just plans that go into yeah. where you're going to deploy, when you're going to deploy. And uh, I love to watch these attacks go down. Look at this, though. King Tim is definitely making a statement on his team. He has the wizard over here taking out some of these uh, building structures. And there's just a lot of cleanup work that they have to do, ranking up the percentage to help his uh, team out there. Such an, uh, a really cool attack with these balloons. So definitely the changes to the balloons have added to this attack, making it super strong again. I mean, I'm ready to switch. I'm ready to start trying Lava Loonian again. I mean, now. it's been a while <laughs> since we did the old Quattro Lava Loonian. <laughs> Uh, but I have a feeling it's coming back, especially after watching these war experts. Because uh, if these guys are using it, then you know it's going to be powerful. Oh, the wizard oh, look at triggers wizard the skeleton, skeleton trap. Who's at it? Uh, Doesn't look it good. Is. Go away. Splashes <laughs> them down. Time's going to run out. All right. He's going to try to get maybe one more structure. That Tesla's got his name on it, though. There it is. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, Two-star, 84%. Wow. Uh,